Hello everyone, and welcome to my Days of Our Lives 24 channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Fans of Coronation Street believe they have discovered Roy Cropper's freedom following a hint on Wednesday night. Roy was only recently placed under custody and made the top suspect in the alleged murder of Lauren Bolton, a teenage girl who vanished. Fans of the soap opera will remember that earlier this year, troubled youngster Lauren abruptly departed the cobbles, leaving love interest Bobby worried when he discovered Lauren's apartment unlocked and nowhere to be found. Watchers nobody saw Lauren go, and judging by her quick disappearance, it appears she told no one close to her about her intention to leave Weatherfield save Roy. Bobby called the police to report Lauren missing, and since Roy is a lovely person, people have been suspicious of him. This is more true now since they discovered that he was cleaning Lauren's apartment without permission, which led some to believe he was guilty and was throwing away evidence. Read more, Met Aaron teases a stunning U-turn in the long-range forecast, raising hopes for a mini heatwave in Ireland. Roy was wrongfully arrested not long ago on suspicion of killing his former employee, and ever since, he has been subjected to a torrent of hatred from internet trolls and detectives working on the case. When Roy discovered on Wednesday night that Christian, the son of his late wife Haley Cropper, had made harsh remarks about him and Haley online, he was left feeling saddened and taken aback. After reading the story, Roy discovered that Christian had implied that Lauren wasn't his first victim and that he had slain Haley. This news devastated Roy. Fans of the long-running soap opera will remember that Haley tragically died in 2014 after deciding to take her own life after being diagnosed with incurable pancreatic cancer. Stu Carpenter expressed his desire to assist Roy in clearing his record, having experienced been falsely convicted himself during a previous erroneous imprisonment. Stu chose to speak with a mystery individual at the precinct who stated there had been talk and she was seen in an attempt to acquire information about Lauren. But before Stu could find out more, he proceeded to take out his wallet and didn't see the man carrying a brick. He returned to Speed Doll with his face covered in blood and his money vanished. The homeless individual claims to have seen Lauren, therefore fans have come up with a theory on Roy's freedom based on this information. Roy will suffer a severe blow in later scenes when he is accused of killing Lauren, the teenage girl who vanished. Roy is scheduled to face charges since D.S. Swain views him as the primary suspect. Roy was falsely detained recently on accusations of killing his former co-worker. A frightened and perplexed Roy waits alone in his police cell, fearing his impending court appearance, in poignant events to come. Viewers have been debating the plot on social media, with some fans offering a scenario that would liberate Roy and disclose Lauren's fate. Someone asked if Lauren would show up unexpectedly for the trial. Hashtag Corey, said one user, while another said, get Lauren to turn up in court, and I feel this will end when Lauren turns at the trial as an unannounced witness. Spoilers for Coronation Street, another ridiculous scandal, this is Adam's new love. There is going to be another shocking affair soon. According to previews on Coronation Street, Adam Barlow's new partner is his co-worker. Fans, however, aren't happy with this new duo and voice concerns about how plausible their relationship is. Adam has a history of being a ladies' guy, as we all know. Will fans laugh this off or find this affair to be exciting? Let's investigate! Spoilers for Coronation Street, Adam Barlow's office romance starts. According to Coronation Street spoilers, Adam Barlow may find love again with Alia Nazir. After they argue in the ensuing week, Adam's feelings for Alia begin to show. It's no secret among fans that Adam has always been charming. The lawyer is headed to impress the women after divorcing his wife Sarah. According to previews for Coronation Street for next week, Johnny meets Rebecca, his new client, in the Chariot Square Hotel and finds the ideal opportunity. Adam notices her, and soon after they begin flirting over a bottle of wine. When Adam doesn't return her calls, Alia manages the meeting with Rich at Fabian's. She soon wins over the client with her knowledge, which results in an offer of employment. Adam and Rebecca exchange passionate kisses at the same moment. Alia enthusiastically accepts Rich's job offer as the week goes on. Spoilers for Coronation Street claim that Adam gets the startling news that his largest client is leaving to work for Fabian. Even worse, Michael Bailey informs Alia inadvertently that Adam is fabricating information concerning her employment status. 
and enraged Alia charges over to face Adam. The two have a heated conversation. But as Alia walks away, Adam falls deeply in love with her. Is he starting to feel something for her? If so, what strategy will he use to prevent her from quitting the company? Still, some quite heated comments were made on Reddit in response to the most recent Coronation Street leaks. One fan wants the show to finally stop airing the recurring affair dramas because they are getting tired of them. Another reader finds this new coupling unbelievable, so they just can't seem real. A third user, meanwhile, could see this coming a mile away. A fourth viewer bemoans Adam's contradictory persona and wishes the program will make a determination on his reliability. They refer to him as being all over the place, equating his actions with his messy hair. Watch what transpires next. Visit TV season and spoilers for more Coronation Street spoilers. A wild night out with Hollyoaks Beauty for Coronation Street star, see pictures here. Famous for playing Rosie Webster on Coronation Street, Helen Flanagan recently went out on the town with Emma Rigby from Hollyoaks and had a crazy time. The two turned Liverpool into a red town when they were there. The couple held their photo together in an Instagram story. But despite all of the glitz and glamour, Helen has recently been open about her difficulties with mental health. Let's examine the images together. Helen Flanagan, a former Coronation Street actress, appreciates a girl's night. Helen Flanagan, the former cast member of Coronation Street, and Emma Rigby from Hollyoaks went out on a girl's night out. Emma is well known for her portrayal of Hannah Ashworth, and Helen is well known for her part in Rosie Webster. With their gorgeous clothes, the two women, who were in their thirties, wowed Liverpool. Emma shimmered in a brown midi dress, and Helen looked fierce in a black halter neck. Posing and snapping pictures, they even posted about their delight on Instagram. The former Coronation Street star previously posted on Instagram to thank everyone for the tremendous love she received after disclosing her issues with mental health. Helen expressed her gratitude to her fans for their nice messages in a moving video. In the video, she stated, I wanted to say thank you so much for all your lovely messages. The soap opera actress said that she was anxious to talk about her struggles, particularly her breakup with Scott Sinclair. The Coronation Street star opened up about her struggle with psychosis, which was brought on by a bad reaction to an ADHD medication. The actress acknowledges that her current situation is far better, though. She also emphasized how much work she had put into improving herself. She also made sure to address the significance of treatment in her recovery process. We hope that she has a happy and prosperous future. Check back often for updates on Coronation Street on TV season and spoilers.